radar tracks opposite lane traffic. It's got a pretty decent range as you can see from the car chicken. You can see the car up there, yeah. But um, it's got a pretty decent range. Uh, the audio works well, as you can hear. And as far as accuracy goes, Another one coming around the corner, but uh, you see the patrol speed 54, 54, 54. Or picking up, and it's picking up the target, so this one's not picking up <laughs> for some reason. Could be interference. I get him in a screaming contest. Side on a dashboard. This is Custom Signals Talon handheld radar. So mounts on the dashboard with the mount that's seen here. The, as you can see, unit functions, function check. It has a patrol mode, which is a moving mode, where it will list control speed and the target speed. It has a um, stationary mode, handheld remote, has a hold which sticks a little bit but it does function and it, as you can tell the audio is working on that target. It's pretty good range because you can't even see the target. It holds back on. Also if you want to a quick look at the traffic, which there's none right now. It quickly um, sends a signal, gets a speed, and locks into speed down here whenever the lock release is depressed. Now I'm operating in a patrol mode, which is a moving mode. I'm going to take the hold off. I'm driving at 25 miles per hour. And that really indicates 25 miles per hour. It's also got a target. I'm going to press the lock to display the lock function. I'm going to put it in hold. Unit's functioning in patrol mode, which is a moving mode. It's also on hold. I'm going to hit the lock release button, which Hits the target, gets the speed. When you release the button, it locks in the speed of the target vehicle and the patrol vehicle. And you release it. You see, patrol speed is 46. About what I'm going here. Get another target. Now, to use the hold button, Listen for the audio. You would release. You would keep the unit on hold until the target's in range, and you would turn, hit the hold button, releasing the hold, which it gets the speed of the target. Now this is the quick track. Alright, lock release, locks in the speed of the vehicle and immediately shuts down. You want to track the vehicle with visual, audio, and radar confirmation. You would hit the hold button to release it. You have a track of the vehicle. You can lock it in place. And it would be the strongest signal. Back on hold. And this is a test. This test circuit shows that all the LEDs are working properly, the light works properly, and the internal test checked out okay. And of course, the, the uh, hold buttons 
lock release and patrol select. They're all light up for so you can see them at night. The remote does show some wear of you, but it works and is functional. This is a nice test of my service Python radar and the People are slowing down for me. Ooh, he's turning me. He's speeding up. Now, this unit is the Python unit is certified by the department every six months, it's current certification. As you can tell, it's within range. 